muscular mice. <laughs> what the hell? No, Tanjiro, you're not ready. You're not ready, Tanjiro. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Chopbox Studios. I'm your host, CJ, and today we've got some more Demon Slayer, baby. You already know I got my Rengoku versus Akaza shirt. This thing looks sick. So let's get into it. And if you guys are new, make sure you leave a like, rate, comment, subscribe below, and become a butcher today for your daily slice of happiness. Helps out the channel a ton. Helps out me make more videos for you guys. So please, please, please make sure you got that bell ring to stay notified for more demon slayer greatness and now without further ado let us continue demon slayer. i also everybody's having a great day today just as much as i am all right it's been a great day <laughs> is oiran the i can't tell if there's two of these people because that one looks different let me read this one first and then I'm done. So I read that one. So that's a different girl, I think, right? I don't even know. Confused now. I'll, you know, the demon one by the pink scarf crap that she uses. Something to give you. And who are these girls? Bro. Oh, some of those hairpins. They get some nice ass hairpins. Yeah, it's okay. Look at all the gold pins she's got in the back of her hair. She probably get a little bit ways away because I don't want to be like cutting my head off up here. I don't know why my camera has to crop it out. I hate that my camera crops my head out. Hmm, Tondra listening to man. Tonight, that's the name of this episode. Tonight, Senko, the one with the yellow hair. Hmm. She fainted. Damn. She's not in a room. Uh oh. Is it regular Zenetsu come back to consciousness or is it OG, like OP Zenetsu? I almost said OG. Forget about it. It's causing him trouble. Look how stressed he is. Damn. So you shut the hell up. Damn. Damn. It's all because they on Warren of Yorn's nerves. There's a demon at my house. Oh, they're like talking about it. <laughs> He's like, I don't know what the fuck. Freaking Inosuke, bro. Hey, Tengen! He didn't make a sound because he's the sound Hashir. I like his swords, bro. I want to see him use his swords so bad. I feel bad about putting you through this. What? Why is he still, like, numb right now? I made some bad decisions. Oh. So that's who's missing. There's been no contact since last night. Uh-oh. Should leave now. Oh shit! Shit's hitting the fan now. You couldn't handle it. Damn. They'll assume that you're dead. Damn, shit's getting real. On my own? I don't know, Tengen, bro. You saw what happened to freaking Rengoku. Damn, man. And he's gone just like that. He, he pulled a Naruto with that speed. The lowest rank? Wait, wait, wait. I need to pause that. All right. Because I got to refresh myself on this. So you got Mizunoto, which is the lowest of the low, I assume. And that's where them three are, apparently. Mizunoe, Kanoto, Kanoe. So they're right below Kana O. Shinoto, Shinoto, Hinoto, Hinoe, Kinoto, Kinoe. 
So they're right below uh, Kano, right? Yeah. Damn. They're that? Nah. They're that, like, low? Sheesh. Watch this. Show me my ranking. What? I didn't know that was a thing. Holy shit. That's actually dope. We call the street of flower engraving and you can say a phrase to flex your muscles to invoke it. It's a sign that you're a demon slayer. <laughs> we don't have time for this. As soon as night falls, I'll head over to Ogimoto house. Okay. Wait for me until then. Investigating my own house today. <laughs> Damn. She's everywhere! Damn. She's just seeing them fucking gossip. <laughs> what is that face, bro? Ew. For real, Zenetsu's gone, bro. What are you gonna do about Zenetsu? I look like a freaking emo person. I'm sorry. Cleaning up after a murder would be a hassle. Like, but what about the, the lady that got murdered in midair? Can be convenient for demons in more ways than one, but also just has to they have to work at night? It would seem suspicious if they weren't around. That's true. I think that not only Zanetsu, but Uzui's wife as well are still alive. I want to take action with that in mind. So, uh, it, I mean, we don't have an answer yet, but is Zanetsu already caught? There's no way. Shit, man. Damn, things are hitting the fake. You know, skate. Y'all went through some shit on the train. Y'all should definitely. Yeah. They were already a good duo on the train, so I think they'll be fine together. So go on and have your dinner. And then why, why, when they leave, she's gonna like change to demon mode, be like. I love you. Are they regular kids though, or are they demons in disguise? Because I still don't know whether to trust those girls or not. Okay, maybe not. Thought she was gonna change. Oh! oh! Damn, and he's decked out. Look at him. <laughs> Bro, you're showing uh, the way you're drunk for certain reasons. I already knew that. Uh oh, and your voice. Even if I were to get a bad feeling about something, I have no way of even looking into it. I. So she's gonna try to get a, get on the runaway. She's gonna freaking try to go settle down somewhere else. What the hell? Disappear either. That was sus. Nah, he picked up on that. I don't want you to disappear either, Suma. That was sus. Here we go. Oh, so they aren't the same. Never mind. I need to devour you before I forget. Damn! Your last night here. Well, they were different people. Okay, so I was correct about that at least, because I was, I was like, I thought I was bugging. I'm like, they look different. So she's dead. Who's Soichiro? The spirit of coming through in my heart. <laughs> what the f <laughs> My soul. What? Wait, what? <laughs> Setting me up with these muscular mice? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> This is so freaking weird. What in the hell? 
That was the weirdest shit I ever seen. But hey. <laughs> It's perfect for his character. That's hilarious. Damn. There we go. We no escape. Getting ready. That's the guy who lost his wife, right? Oh, shit. Now. Oh, shoot. Ooh. Uzui ain't. I mean, yeah, Uzui. He ain't playing. I, I can't decide whether to call him Tengen or Uzui. Fell in and I left for a creamy Tell me everything that you think might be relevant about his wife, basically. Who are you suspecting? Damn. <laughs> Things are going down, man. I'll kill whoever it is. Warubihime. Warubihime. That has no life. Damn, so he knows exactly who it is, too. And he's already gone. He said, yep, I know where that is. Oh my god, is Ten getting gonna go freaking confront her? I swear on my life, bro. I ain't ready. And it's gonna be the next episode that we get something fire, bro. Oh, I already know. Damn, let this man go. Let's try to pinpoint demons. She's still alive. She's information either way the demon should be back here by daybreak I'll dispose of it with my own two hands that's actually big brain because if you can corner in a room it can't go anywhere you can just kill it right there and then bro I want to know what, what happened to Zenetsu though oh shit oh oh they actually laid eyes on it that yellow hair ugly brat what will he be here soon why do they keep focusing on her body so much <laughs> damn her body She's not bleeding. No scent of blood. I never devoured dirty old people or anyone ugly. Oh! No, Tanjiro, you're not ready. You're not ready, Tanjiro. Oh shit, man. Oh shit. One hit. One hit. <laughs> Look at his face. He's like, oh shit. You're fucked. You shouldn't have even tried. Body's numb. Oh, is it poison? I wouldn't be alive. True? Tadro, no, I don't know, man. You gotta wait. You gotta hold out. You gotta hold out. You're gonna freaking get bodied. Oh, because you hit your back so hard. Then what about Nezuko? How'd she feel if you hit your back that hard? She can absorb humans inside of it. What? I couldn't find a secret path that Hima could fit through. She needs to do is abduct humans. Is a crack big enough for the... Oh, so that's how... It that's weird. Not as fragile as I thought. I do like your eyes. I just gouge out your eyeballs and devour them. Damn. Damn. What? Oh shit! It's sure to be destroyed. Oh, she doesn't. He doesn't want Nezuko to come out. I don't know, man. She's like, oh. <laughs> don't leave. For real. Oh shit! 
Here we go. Oh, no. Turbulent. Oh, oh, okay. That's three, four. Mm, okay. Did a good job evading. But we got more. Oh, shit. They combined into one super bandage. Yo. Tanjiro's holding it down right now. Ooh. Come on, Tanjiro. Oh, let's go. They're bleeding, though. You see that? What the hell? Yo, he's actually holding it down. Oh, what the hell? She just... Did he just slice her in half? Look at... Because you see the thing behind him? I'm not trying to be loud. See? Oh, my God. Wait, is she dead or is she, like, good? And then, like, she, you just got to pull her out the paper. I don't even know how that works. How cute is that? As ugly as you are. Damn. Hey, you can't talk shit, bro. He dodged a lot of your bandages. Please tell me Tengen's about to appear. Come on, Tengen! That's what I'm saying. You only did it one time. He's gonna do Hinokami! He's gonna try Hinokami, bro! And it, the, the episode's gonna fucking end! No! I wanna see him use that so bad. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it, man. That was getting so good. He was about to use Hinokami because I know that stance, dude. He was just about to use that shit. And I kid you not. How much you want to bet? And I'm saying this right now. How much you want to bet? Next episode, he's going to use Hinokami. Either that or Uzui or one of the others are going to show up. That's what's gonna happen. I can guarantee you that. I didn't expect him to actually fight her like right now at the end of this episode, but he actually did a good job dodging all those things. So that was actually pretty, that was uh, props to Tanjiro, okay? You did really good dodging all those bandages and the uh, super bandy and all that stuff, whatever it is. Now we know her power, which she can kind of like encase someone within her uh, bandage thing still don't know what i should call it i'm just gonna call it a bandage i'm gonna keep calling it a bandage and we saw that with the lady that she was like basically inside of it kind of like han solo bicarbonate type shit you know she was just fucking stenciled on there i don't know how you get them out though like if she's got to get them out or if you could just like pull them peel them off like a stick i don't know how that works i i really don't it's getting good it's getting great you already know the deal so that was episode 11 ladies and gentlemen if i had to rate the episode i'd probably rate it a 9 out of 10 it was another really really well done episode we got to see more about this demon and how her powers work and now we're getting into the juicy stuff as you know so I can't wait for the next episode now, obviously, because that was just a cliffhanger and a half right there. Especially if he's going to use Hinokami. That's going to be freaking sick. So if you guys are ready to do differently and you want to see more Demon Slayer, make sure you leave a like, rate, comment, subscribe below, and become a butcher today for your daily slice of happiness. Helps out the channel a ton. Helps out me make more videos for you guys. So please, please, please make sure you got that bell ringing to stay notified for more Demon Slayer in the future. Till then, I will see you guys in the next reaction. Peace.